Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello guys. Welcome to our channel with me in Jakarta Bali and my friend. Sama Rasya Zahra in Morpo. Roji Talk Show. But this is not our channel, right? Sure. But today we are going to analyze the Roman album. From which album is Hana? The album is Who Work and Roy Jet. I see. I know some of the song from that album. And today we have a special guest star. He is very amazing and inspiring person. Do you know who is he? Of course. Who doesn't know him? He is a very famous lecturer. Let's Thank give you. big applause for our guest star, Mr. Deddy Sulaiman. Thank you for inviting me to come here. Oh, sir, how are you today? You look so great. Yeah, I am great as always. Thank I'm you. Great. What about you? Yeah, I'm great. Okay, that's good. Okay, sit down please. Thank you. Yeah, I am happy because uh, you have invited uh, me to come here and I like morphology, I like to share with you. I am happy. Thank you. Today we will analyze the Nomad's album, the Mr. Daily Slide. Well, with me, so before we get ahead, we will introduce all this stuff. Right, sorry. Good morning, Bandung, December 29, um, 1979. This last infection was a doctoral degree from the flight. The lesson on December uh, 29, 2020, with uh, fine at 4 0 Before we get analysis the album, if you have to know that what property is and how it relates to the question by you explain a little to us and the audience about this term. Um, morphology uh, with this semester I mean, uh, this is why right that, you know, we have different era, uh, people in the past will come to university to learn about many theories related to linguistic, chronology, morphology, but today we have different because when you will graduate uh, in two or three years later, the world is different. Okay, so that's uh, in this case, uh, I am applying the case study of our morphology today, how our morphology uh, answer or face of uh, the song like in your era. Probably I don't know the song of uh, you in your era, but then I know morphology, so that we uh, integrate, we combine uh, from me, the theory of morphology, and from you, the song, you analyze, we analyze, that is morphology for today. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you, sir. Next mm -hmm. is explanation about Bruno Mars and his album. Okay. First, this is about Bruno Mars. Mm -hmm. His real name is Peter Gates, and he is an American singer, from writer, and record producer. Mm -hmm. He is known for his stage performance, and also expensive, and for performing in a wide range of musical style, including pop, R&B, funk, so reggae, disco, and rock. Mm. And 
and then Mars is accompanied by his band, the polygons, who play a variety of in instruments, such as electric guitar, bass, piano, keyboard, drum, and horns, and also serve as backup singer and dancer. Singer, that's the way you are. For the best man of the vocal performance at the Grammy World, and this is the study of who who works and who gets was nominated for the Gold of the Year at the 5th Forum and the Mount Rainier Award. Well, well then was nominated for the Gold of the Year and Song of the Year. And this is the list of the songs in the album. There are the name, This is the way you are, our first time, Runaway Baby, The Lazy Song, Marry You, Talking to the Moon, Reports or Blues, Count on Me, The Other Side, Just the Way You Are Remix, and Somewhere in Your Life. Mm -hmm. And now move to the analysis of the song. We just add some song for analysis. First, this is this the way you are. You can see there is the word signing. Isn't there from the word signing? So why did it become so exciting? Well, um, ladies and gentlemen, you can see the slides, yeah. Um, because this morphology, probably we have uh, from the first line, like all oh, her eyes, her eyes. In the word of her, we have two morphemes actually. This is not, this is one word, but two morphemes. Why does it consist of two morphemes? Because her uh, could be divided into smaller parts. The first is she. And the second is possessive. So she plus possessive becomes her. And then eyes, yeah, although we have two eyes here, eyes is a couple. So this is one eye, and this is an eye. So eyes also consist of two things. And your question is about shining. Yeah, shining from shine and ink. Because they, uh, this is, they are not signing. They are, there is to be are here, and signing is uh, the verb. Uh, it is continuous form. So signing consists of the root of shine and him. Yeah, also prime, this is uh, the same, shining, priming. But you know, uh, here, although the, the word is the same, signing and prime, but the function is different. In this signing, because they, uh, this is R, they are signing, so shining is a verb different from her trying, her trying. So uh, after the pronoun her, it must be noun. So trying is gerund. Gerund is the, the form uh, from verb to be a noun, gerund. So shining and trying is different. I think that's all. All right, so mm -hmm. how about the word everyday and perfectly. Well, um, everyday and perfectly because um, yeah, this is also different. The first perfect is adjective, and then we uh, not we add actually, but uh, naturally this is uh, perfectly. Uh, there is we here, so it is adverb. So there are two monograms as well. The first is perfect, and the second is we perfectly. This is different from this everyday, ladies and gentlemen, because everyday is a com is a compound word. Compound word, uh, you know, every is a root form and day is a root form. Both of them are the three motifs. Every has a meaning. Day has a meaning. So when this is uh, it has a meaning, it has a meaning. This is called by compound word. This is different from perfectly because we has no meaning, but uh, it, uh, it contains meaning in we. But every and day, both of them are words, so every day is a compound word. Thank you so much. And then the next one. Uh, next is Sandy. Who likes the words in song talking to me? Yeah. Uh, the analysis, um, yeah, talking to the moon, 
Yeah, I know you're somewhere, somewhere, and you know somewhere also the compound one because we know some and we know where, but somewhere is compound. This is called my compound because there is no space. If there is a space, like you know, sometime we have some time with the space and some time without the space. It has a different meaning. Some time and some time. Uh, the pronunciation is the same. Some time, some time. But uh, somewhere here is the compound word. There is no space here. And then talking. Yeah, talking is the word. Uh, it consists of talk and in and crying by and in. Yeah, this is also the. Uh, this is not here. Uh, this is uh, present. Okay. This is present. Talking. Present. It consists of two. This is the same. I think this is the same. Talking, crying. Yeah, talking and talking. Um, it helps you are on the other side talking. Are talking. So this talking has the relation to are here. Yeah. So talk uh, must be in. The verb uh, is present for this. Or am I talking? So this is am. Okay, and talking. And the next one is in. Next, uh, some of you know about the word banana and tea. What are the words? Well, um, yeah, in this word, uh, this is new, but new uh, has been for about uh, 10 years and more. Wana is from uh, two or three more friends. It depends on the next words, like I think I want to marry you, I hear one and two. If this is M, uh, uh, for, uh, for example, I am, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, am. So gonna would be go, in, and to. There are three more things. If there is M here, but uh, this I want to marry, it consists of two concerns. The first is one, and the second is two. This is not uh, on this, so just uh, two more things. Okay. Um, yeah. I think in the term of three and bottom of times, uh, this is the same. Like now, greetings, because this is greetings with us. So greetings consists of greetings and greeting. The greeting also divided into greet and in. So it consists of three movements. Greetings. Standing, two movements, stand and in, coming, come and in, feeling, feel and in. But I don't know this is a new form. Uh, what is this? Try now. Okay. From try to scratch. Try now. Okay. Uh, probably in morphology, uh, we see this is the analogy. If one is want to, gonna is uh, go to or going to, right now would be from try to. Okay, that's good. Um, going nowhere, going from go and in nowhere, from no and where, but this is without space, so this is compounded. Mesh, I think uh, this is from mesh and iri, and this is the same. To, to Okay, um, our first time, Lion 6, uh, is it from here? Uh, um, sorry. Okay, um, there are two lines here. The first is... Okay, our first time. Starting, uh, starting uh, from star and A and then Gonna, I think we have some uh, repetition like gonna, gonna, been doing. Okay, this is good. Been uh, from being doing, uh, from do and aim parts, 
from hard and as require from require require and that plan German plan from plan and easy plan gonna nothing uh, we have the petition from your go and your like like ice cream on Sunday gonna eat uh, uh, go to eat yeah, from German Yeah, this is the next song. Uh, she was cover. Uh, cover consists of cover and ED, but cover here it would be past participle because of was. Uh, it means the past participle word. It consists of the cover and the past participle. Unfair. This is good. This is new. Fair is an adjective that is un to negate the words, but still objective. This is intentional and somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. Yeah, this is the same. See, somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. This is the same. And sitting uh, consists of sit and eating, listening from listen and eating, waiting, started waiting. This is good one. While we were waiting, started conversating. This is nice. Nice word because uh, you know song uh, as a creative uh, language. You know this is uh, inform and then past form inform. Waiting is from wait and in start start and eating converse. Yeah, this is new and I think this is creative uh, conversation. You know uh, in uh, everyday life we have conversation, but this is conversation while we were waiting started conversating this is nice because uh, you know we have conversation and the word ended by peon is a noun and uh, conversating means so this is the verb but uh, i don't know whether this is converse uh, without in conversate uh, this is nice i mean the like in is because waiting conversating the, the the root form would be converse or conversate. Uh, this is nice. Uh, conversate probably. Well, um, yeah, truth of the matter is I am complicated. Yeah, I am complicated is subjective. Uh, this is from. from this is from from complex, 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 compli, uh, complicated, uh, complicated from easy, complicated, complicated, complex and complicated. Uh, this is a complicated from complicated. Yeah, I understand. I think this is uh, a word uh, because uh, this is not from under and stand. This is understand. This is one word. Understand. We'll be waiting and Goda. Goda. Goda is from uh, all you get going to, but uh, not going to. Um, can to, go to. Yeah, this is from two muffins. Going to do is cross. All you have uh, go from go to. Uh, but you just go to decide. Not gonna, gonna, gonna decide, but gonna decide. Yeah. This is nice because in one album we have uh, like trying. In some songs, this is trying. In a particular song, this is trying. Trying. And also, gonna, we have, we have also gonna. This is a nice um, discussion. You will be waiting, the same, waiting, the same. Wonderland, this is compound words. Because we have wonder, wonder and land without space. Because this is without space, this is not, not a phrase. This is a um, uh, compound word. The last, last one is very Okay, yeah. it will be the last one. Yeah, I gave you all I had and you toast. Yeah, because this is easy. I think this is easy. Toast and toast. Also, all the muffins. 
Yeah, if you mark, you highlight the words, the same word like post, this is the same, post and ed, post. And then this is the last one. Today I don't feel like doing anything, yeah, doing, uh, uh, there are two morphemes, do anything, and your thing is compounded. I just want one lay, or one lay here, want to, like, picking, picking is different, uh, pick and ink, doing anything the same, I'm going to, okay, this is, I'm going to kick, I am going to, so gonna here, it consists of two morphemes, because this is am, so it must be go and in and to. I am going to, I'm gonna go in and to. This one from I gonna, so I go to. But I am gonna still the same, gonna, but there's am, it consists of three moments. Go and in and to. Launching, chilling, the same, and then breaking, uh, I am breaking. This is uh, the, the normal thing for me. This is for uh, for being objective. This is objective from frame, uh, frame long, long, longing and chaotic. I think that's all for the explanation, the analysis. Wow, thank you very much. Sir. Okay. Um, such a great explanation. We hope we can meet in another time and another time. I hope so. I hope so.